Hello and welcome. I'm Courtney Burgess and I'm here at Whippy Oshawa Honda where we've got city deals with a country feel. And today we're checking out this beautiful 2017 Honda Civic sedan in the EX trim level in a gorgeous modern steel metallic finish. This particular model comes to us with a clean car proof and under the hood we've got a 2 liter IV Tech 4 cylinder engine with port injection matched to a continuously variable transmission capable of approximately 158 horsepower. Equipped with LED daytime running lights, projector beam halogen headlights with auto on and off, so you'll have no issues lighting your way. Coming around the side here, you'll see we're riding atop 16 inch aluminum alloy wheels with power assisted ventilated front disc brakes and solid rear disc brakes. And plenty of tread left on those tires for you. When it's time to hop on in, you'll, ha you'll notice the proximity key entry system given away by that lock button right on the door there. Check out our tutorial for more info on that. We've also got your key fob here with lock, unlock, remote start, trunk release, and panic button. So let's hop on in. Taking a peek inside now on our door, we've got our power mirrors, locks, and windows, as well as our trunk release right down there. And inside we've got a gorgeous black fabric interior with our six-way manually adjustable driver's seat, four-way manually adjustable passenger seat, beautiful interior there. We've also got our adjustable height seat belts and tilt and telescopic steering wheel so you can get quite comfortable. Down below here we've got our hood release. So let's hop on in for a closer look. Checking out our analog display here with center digital screen. We can see absolutely everything we need to just too easily using controls right on the steering wheel. You can scroll through, see absolutely everything just too easily. I love it. But the main exciting takeaway from this, 4,417 kilometers on this vehicle at this moment in time. To the left of the steering wheel, we've got our collision mitigation braking system, road departure warning, and vehicle stability assist. At the end of our multifunction stick here, we've got our blind spot camera. The vehicle also comes with a backup camera. Check out our tutorial video for more info on that. Great features to have. On the steering wheel itself, we've got these directional arrows and enter button, as well as this information button. That's how I was scrolling through that information right over there earlier. We've got this incredibly sensitive swipe or click. Uh, volume control, meaning you can go up quickly or down quickly or just have that little bit of perfect tiny control. Lots of options for you. Just below that we've got our phone and Bluetooth options. Over on the other side of the wheel we've got our cruise control options there, all the buttons. And over this way you can see it is a push button start. I've actually got the keys stashed in my pocket for safekeeping at the moment. And here you can see our touch screen. We can scroll through using the buttons right on there because it is, a t or using the touch screen because it is a touch screen. Check out all these different ways to listen to your music and you can also use these buttons along the side to navigate through. From your main page here, we've got your, your audio, phone, info settings, Honda Link Connect and your smartphone connection, so your Android Auto or Apple CarPlay, as well as whatever else you want to add. Love it. And the display touchscreen is incorporated into the uh, climate control. So you do have a dual zone cli automatic climate control. You can set them separately just to easily combining the tactile buttons below and the button that brings up the climate control options right in your touchscreen. So you have full control there. We've also got heated seats up here with three levels of warmth. Down here we've got this wonderful little storage tray with that open center hole there at the back. You can see it's perfect for leading cables down through because it connects to this secondary storage and charging area where we've got a 12 volt power outlet and USB port. And as you can see that little smartphone symbol there on the USB port, that is to show you that that's the, USB, the one USB port to use if you want to play your music or load your pictures to your car. Checking out our gear selector here, very sleek and stylish, and we've got the brake hold and electronic parking brake as well as econ button just over here as well. In our center storage here, we've got our sliding armrest that opens right on up, plenty of storage there. This moves, this moves and can be removed for your cup holders, this moves, we've got a great little water bottle kind of there and another USB port. So no fighting over who gets to charge their electronics. 
Over on the passenger side, we've got our glove box with plenty of space as well as manuals there. And looking up top, we've got our controls for the interior cabin lights as well as controls for the power moonroof. Perfect for those bright sunshiny days, although maybe not so much fun on, with the rain today. But we know those bright sunny days are coming. We've also got illuminated vanity mirrors for driver and front passenger. And so much more. I can't wait to go check it all out. Checking out the back seat now, we've got plenty of room for five passengers total with tons of legroom as well. I've actually got the driver's seat moved as far back as it can go, so you're guaranteed at least this much space. In comparison, I have the passenger seat moved as far forward as possible, showing how much room you can really have to stretch out. As you can see, we've got the seat back pocket on the passenger side there. And if you don't quite need room for five passengers, you can always lower that middle seat to add armrests and cup holders just that easily. And if you're more concerned about cargo space than passenger capacity, let's go take a peek at the trunk. Checking out the Civic from behind, you'll notice our backup camera mounted here just below and to the left of that Honda logo. And we'll use our key fob once again to simply press and hold and pop the trunk on open. Once inside, we have a sizable trunk here. Tons of room for whatever you may need. We've got your temporary spare just down there. And as you can see, we've got a split 60-40 back for the back seat there, meaning we can put down one, two, or all three seats and extend the cargo space. So let's take a look at how much space we can add. Just like that, we've put the whole back seat down, extending your cargo space all the way up. This has gone from a five-seater down to a two-seater, but you have all of this long storage space now. And if you need to add a seat back, there you go. It's just that easy. And you still have all of this long storage space. That's about it for your quick peek at this beautiful 2017 Honda Civic sedan in the EX trim level in a gorgeous modern steel metallic finish. But there's still so much more to see. And our friendly and knowledgeable sales associates would love to help find the perfect vehicle for you. So call, click, or come on into our showroom at Whitby Oshawa Honda at 300 Thixon Road South, just off the 401. Don't forget to check out our YouTube channel and subscribe to see more. I'm Courtney Burgess. Thanks for watching.